Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to reset Windows 11, how to factory reset in Windows 11. So if your PC or laptop is laggy, it's not performing well, if you have some issues with your uh, Windows 11, or probably you are planning to sell your uh, laptop or computer, then you should go with resetting your Windows 11. I will be explaining you step by step that how you have to reset it and then how you can delete the previous uh, file so that it should not occupy a lot of space and your computer can work much faster. So what you have to do on Windows 11, right click on the Windows icon and then choose settings. Now here scroll down and you will find the option of recovery. Click on recovery and then here you will find reset this PC. But if you have just issues with your uh, computer like lagging or with any particular application, you can also try fix problem without resetting your PC. Click on it, then it will give you troubleshoot options. You can go with recommended troubleshooter history, click on other tr troubleshooters and then you can run the troubleshooter for particular application or feature where you have the problem with. Okay, but if you do not want to go with this, go back again and then click on reset this PC on the right hand side. Now, here you will be getting two options. Keep my files, remove everything. So let's say that if you want to reset your PC so that it should give you the good performance, then you can go with keep my file so that it should not be harmed. But if you want to sell your computer or you want that it should work absolutely perfect, smoother, and you don't care about your data, then you can go with the second option. So let's say if I want to go with keep my file so that you won't uh, lose any of your data. So click on it. And this will take some time. And it says additional setting, restore apps and setting which came with this PC. So what you can do, just click on change settings. And it says restore pre-installed apps, restore apps and setting which came with this PC. What will happen that whichever application that comes along with your Windows 11, that will be automatically installed. So you can confirm it. If you want to disable, then you can disable it. But if you want that, then you can go with yes. Then hit on confirm. Now you have to click on next. And it says getting things ready. So this, way, this won't take too long. Okay, so now it says resetting will change setting back to their default. Keep personal files, reinstall windows from this device, remove all application and programs. So what kind of application and program will be uninstalled and removed? You can view by clicking on view app that will be removed. And you can see Chrome remote desktop host, Droid Cam, Google Chrome, Google Drive, Java, Microsoft Edge. So these all application will be removed from your PC and then you need to manually install it. Okay, so you must know before resetting your Windows 11 PC. So if that's fine with you, then you can go back and click on reset. Okay, and after that, you can also make a list that what all application will be uninstalled and removed. And then once it's been resetted, you can install them back. So once you're done, click on reset. And now this will start preparing to restart and this will completely reset your PC depending that how much data you have it will take some time so now you will be getting another screen that says resetting this PC so depending that how much data you have how much application you have and so depending on that it will take some time if you have not too much then it won't take so much time I would recommend you that uh, just do not press any kind of key on your keyboard and wait until this process has been completed. Now in case if you are resetting this PC option get stuck on a specific percentage like on 16, 37 or 99 percent then wait for some time and still if you find that it has been stuck and not moving then what you have to do press and hold the power button both on your laptop or PC for 5 to 10 seconds until it gets forced shut down. Once it shut down, you have to restart the PC again and then it will probably uh, reset the PC or it will roll back 
and if it rolls back then again you have to try the same process once done the computer will restart and it says preparing so the process will be like through the installation so you have to wait now and now you see that it says installing please keep your computer on and plugged in so if you have laptop make sure that it's full charged or just connect with your adapter so now let it get installed so now once it's been done you will get the login screen so you have to click and type your same password that you had before So now the PC has been resetted and you see a fresh copy of your Windows 11 machine. And now there are a few things that you have to do after the PC has been resetted. So the first thing will be you need to remove the file that you don't need. So open your file explorer. Then go to this PC. Here you'll see your local disk C. Right click on it. Choose properties. Then click on disk cleanup. And then from here you can see downloaded program file then your temporary inter internet files and even if you see the old operating system file then you can check that option and then you have to empty recycle bin the temporary file then click on ok okay so now this will start deleting the files and once you are done with this process again you have to open your file explorer go to local disk c then on windows then look for software distribution here it is double click on it then double click on download and whatever file you see here you also need to delete that so now after doing all this process if you're looking for a well a working windows 11 then you will be getting it so make sure that you follow the step carefully and do not skip any part and if this video was useful for you then please consider subscribing to the channel like the video and still if you have any question then let me know in the comment section till then take care bye bye